welcome to Mobile World Congress here in Barcelona. Here on the Exynos booth we've got some really interesting technology demonstrations. We're going to look at those in a little bit more detail further on. So here we have a basic Android device. It's running the Android 2.2, which is the Froyo. And usually in a Android you can only use one application at a time and it will take up the whole screen. So what we have done here is we have actually introduced windowing. So you can close the windows or put them smaller, you can resize the windows, you can move them around and you can switch between different windows. And as you can see, we also have this application running on the background. So it doesn't go into a suspend mode, but it keeps running while you are doing actions on the other window. So now we're going to see the application of our multiple windows running on Android into a device category which is not normally supported. We have actually now created a dual screen. I'm going to pass over to have a look at this in some more detail. So what we have here is, is now instead of multiple applications in one screen, you can launch from this side of the screen to the other side of the screens and, and back. Or if you want to use it in a multitasking manner, you, you put the one application here as a full-blown app, Android application and then start the other one here. And then continuing your activities with really doing doing the, what you started first, composing a message to your friends and, and then sending it, sending it to your friends and, and, and getting back to the original situation where you were. We have to remember now that uh, running all this now in 7 inch or bigger screen really enables the efficient use of the whole workspace. Not maybe the biggest thing, but if, imagine if you turn these screens and use the other screen as a QWERTY, then you actually have a laptop. Hey, hello. We have here a kind of a MIGO application demonstration. Um, the current uh, challenge is that um, the proliferation of these kind of smart devices is um, it's making it very difficult to ensure this kind of adoption of the mobile services as well as this kind of a consistent user experience. And uh, what we have done here, we have, a, um, we have taken this application on top of Miko, just as an example. We have two sets of um, kind of uh, versions of Miko. One is uh, 1.1 for the handsets. So we have this tablet and a handset. And also Miko 1.1 on, on top of this um, idea pad or tablet. Basically what we have done here is the um, kind of user experience design for all these devices and this same concept and user experience goes through all these devices and basically the same same kind of functionality is available on these smaller devices as well as these notebooks. And the hardware what we are using here is uh, kind of based on Intel, Intel chips and uh, the, the hardware, this is AVA tablet, AVA handset, as well as this kind of Lenovo idea pad. So, Mobile World Congress is drawing to a close. Uh, we've had literally hundreds of visitors across our stand to see our technology innovations and solutions. So, we'll look forward to seeing you again next year.